Griddle Master. Cooking up the good stuff. Hey, Griddle Master Joe here with you. Um, oh my gosh, what are these? These are the the refrigerated version doughs. So, we're gonna cook them on a standard barbecue. One that has a dome like my Weber. So if you'd like to know how I made this dough, click right up here and we have a detailed uh, video for you, not too long, that shows you how to make this dough. And this is with a biga and, and uh, it's a, it's a pre-done little part. And then you, since this is the refrigerator one, this one was setting for 48 hours in the refrigerator. Now, what I learned in my other video, and actually, I'm gonna just do it like this, like I've been. Check this out. I'm not even gonna use the peel in initially. We're just gonna set that on there for about a minute. In the meantime, I'm gonna go ahead and do the next one. This is ready. And what I mean by ready, it's ready for me to build. I'm gonna do this. Put this on the peel. Tell them why we cook it first. We pre-cook it because this has such a hydrate, high hydration and it, it's wet, so it doesn't come off the peel very well. So when you just do it for about a minute like I did, you're gonna see this come off the peel real easy. I'm gonna do this just like, nah, I'm gonna break them up. <coughs> Trisha, don't do that. <coughs> Great. All right, so I'm gonna put this right. I forgot I have my. See how that came right off? And there we go. Now we can make the other one. So we're doing one on the stone and one not on the stone. Now I mix the pizza sauce with some, some chopped tomatoes, which looks really, really, really good. Griddle Master Junior Junior wants some garlic, roasted garlic at that, and oregano on his. All right, put this on the stone.
Now that I've gone that far, I'm gonna, whoo, hot. I'm gonna put that on the cooling rack so we get it off, off of the griddle top. So I just had it on the, on the griddle for a couple minutes initially, a, a minute on, on to get the dough firmed up a little. Then I built it and then I put it on the griddle top for about two minutes and now I'm pulling it off and going to stick it on the cooling rack which helps the air to circulate around and cook everything. So that's exciting. Nice. Real nice. You want to show up, take a picture of the bottom? That was nice. That, that, let me see if I could hold it up for you. How's that? Still real hot, so the, the is melting. And this one was the one on the uh, cooling rack. Cool. The bottom of that one that you burn more. The cooling rack one? Right, because the pizza stone makes it even more more consistent. Alright, so I hope you've enjoyed it. Remember to like us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, ring the bell on YouTube so that way you get notified with every uh, new video that we put out. Alright, so Griddle Master Joe, hope you've enjoyed this. Uh, see you next time.